Okay, so here we are again. Um, this time I'm going to use NPX. Okay, and I'm not going to explain the differences. You can read the differences and research for that, but what I will say is that I'm learning what the difference is between creating a React app with NPM and NPX here at Lambda School. That's what I'm learning. So, Let's go back over here to the documentation. And the first thing I'm going to do again is open up my terminal. And I'm actually going to uninstall um, create React app with NPM. Because if you see right here, it tells you if you've previously installed create React app globally via NPM, which is exactly what I did, just this. We recommend you uninstall the package using npm uninstall dash g create react app. So I copied that. I'm going to paste it right here. And then I'm going to hit enter. And it is going to uninstall the global installation of the create react app um, tooling. So you see there, it removed 91 packages. And if I do create react app, it should tell me no package installed or command not understood. Create React app command not found. Okay. So the next thing we're going to do is install it with NPX. And it says here uh, to ensure that NPX always uses the latest version. And that's pretty much what it does. It doesn't install it on your system but it always uses the version of um, the latest version of Node, which is, I believe, what um, installs the package. NPX comes with NPM 5.2 plus higher. Oh boy. See instructions for older NPM versions. Okay. So, this is what we're going to do next. NPX, create React app. And I deleted the old one, so I'm just going to name this one that same thing. React app one. Enter. Yeah, okay. And just just to confirm, I did not create it on my desktop this time. I just went ahead and created it in my home directory. which is indicated by the little, uh, is that the tilde? I don't remember. The little squiggly. All right, so there you have it. We have created a React app with NPX instead of NPM. And if I do the same thing, I go code, space, and then period, and then enter, and it opens it in my VS code. I'm gonna close it, and yeah. Uh, no thanks. No, no thanks. No thanks. Okay. So, there it is. 
going to open the terminal. And I'm going to do npm start. And there we are. Created a laptop with NPX.